Hey, what's going on guys? Tim here again. Got another tutorial for you today. Bring another quick lanyard knot tutorial, but this knot uh, could be made into a bracelet. We'll probably save that for a uh, later tutorial. So we're doing the double wall knot today, and uh, you can also consider this almost like a double snake knot, but technically speaking, um, this is the uh, wall knot. And it is from the Ashley Book of Knots. I forget which number it is, but I'll add it in the description and title. So anyways, let's get into it. I've got two different colors, just for clarity. Okay, I've got red and blue. I've got about a foot here, but I'm just doing one knot, so we won't need that much. So let's start off with the blue. We're going to bring it over in front of the red, make a loop, and go behind the red, like so. Okay, so this is where you should be. Now we're going to take the red, we're going to go behind the blue and bring it to the front like this. And then the red will go through like that. Okay, so this is where it should be. So from, he, from here, um, you're basically just going to double up the red and blue. Okay, so let's make these a little smaller. I'm going to take the red. You're going to go behind the blue strand again. Okay, and you're going to bring it around to the front and go through this blue loop again. Like that. Okay, now for the blue... You're just going to follow, follow the same strand and you're going to go over this red strand and go through the blue loop here, or the red loop here, sorry, like that, okay? So you've just more or less tied a walnut or snake knot and then you've doubled over the two uh, loops. And now when we pull, boom. There we go. That is our double walnut. So let me uh, cinch this up a bit more nicely. And there we go. That is the double walnut. Very nice. A um, little bit different take on the, uh, I guess you can call it the snake knot as well. But uh, I think this would make great for a lanyard knot. It's a little bit smaller than a diamond knot, so um, you still probably could use it for a, a closure, for a clasp. But uh, yeah, that is the double wall knot, and uh, there you go. We're going to be doing a bracelet out of this one soon. I'm sure you can guess how, but uh, yeah, that'll be coming very soon. All right, guys, so that is it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this one. Nice, quick, simple. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for more lanyard knot tutorials as well as uh, paracord bracelet tutorials. All right, guys, uh, that is it for me today. Remember, if you're looking for great sources to buy a paracord and uh, paracord materials and stuff like that, check out all my affiliate links down below. Because every time you guys shop through my uh, Amazon affiliate links, you are helping out this channel greatly. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.